Dr. Salib Masood. I'm a pulmonologist, and today I want to discuss about pneumonia uh, in collaboration with Bonaire Healthcare. Uh, what is pneumonia? Pneumonia is invasion of the lung by microorganisms, uh, which include bacteria, viruses, fungi, and a subsequent uh, changes that happen uh, after the body responds to this invasion. What age group is generally affected by pneumonia? So all age groups are generally affected by pneumonia. <coughs> but uh, pneumonia is more common, especially in the younger population and the older population. <coughs> and it's more severe in the younger population and the older populations because of uh, maybe immune, uh, immune uh, system. What causes pneumonia and how does it come about? So pneumonia is caused by microorganisms uh, invading the lungs. So this microorganism could be bacteria, viruses, fungus, and they get to the lung usually through the, the upper airway, through the nose, the mouth, uh, as the commonest cause. They can also get to the lung through blood, uh, if they get into the blood and eventually uh, end up in the lung or sometimes they can also maybe come from the skin if there's a, a wound on the skin, but this is very rare. So people pick this bacteria and uh, this microorganism and put them in their noses, mouth, either by getting too close to pe other people or maybe just picking them from surfaces and touching their faces and eventually travel down into the lungs and start uh, invading the lung. What are the predisposing factors? <coughs> so the commonest uh, predisposing factor uh, of pneumonia is uh, the environment. So for example, overcrowding, uh, this will predispose you to getting pneumonia. So basically hand hygiene and uh, uh, what is called aerosol hygiene. So being too close to people, being too close to many people at the same time in overcrowded environment, for example, prisons, boarding schools, or any other crowded places. So this will put you at a, at a very high risk of getting pneumonia and other respiratory infections. Uh, the other thing is age. So the younger the age or the older the age, also that predisposes you because your immune system may not be able to fight this invasion very effectively. Uh, the other thing is uh, <clears throat> if you have any other condition that affects your immune system, uh, like diabetes, uh, HIV, this also will put you at a, at a, a high risk of getting uh, pneumonia. And also other congenital uh, diseases, there are some other congenital diseases which affect the way the lung uh, helps protect itself, uh, like cilia problem. So this will also predispose you to, to uh, getting pneumonias. And um, lastly, uh, maybe is um, if you have condition that uh, will affect your level of consciousness, because you have, for you to protect your airways, you have to be conscious. So if you lose your consciousness, then you'll not be able to feel uh, like fluids dripping down to your lungs and cough them out. Uh, these conditions include, for example, people uh, getting blackouts after drinking or people being in a coma uh, for one reason or another. Then that can also predispose them from uh, getting uh, pneumonia. I want to thank you for listening to these uh, sessions with Bonaire Healthcare. And uh, if uh, there's any more inquiries, any more information necessary, we can always uh, provide. You can book uh, our clinic or our services uh, through Ponea Healthcare Platform, and uh, then we can connect and uh, discuss more. We are looking forward to, the, to more sessions like this one, uh, and trying to educate patients and uh, inform them of uh, uh, what is available in terms of respiratory health uh, care. Thank you very much and have a good day.